Yo, what's going on guys? It's the Beast Pokeballer here as always coming at you guys with the next NPA battle. It is week 8 of the NPA aka National Pokemon Association and today we are battling Key Darkness Dragon and the Los Angeles Clef Keys. I've done a good amount of preparing for this battle. I think I'm ready. I have a pretty good strategy. He doesn't really have any spinners or defoggers. He has a couple Pokemon that can set up rocks. Uh, Cobalion. <clears throat> Terrakion, Agron, etc. But I think overall I've crafted a pretty nice team to take him on. This is of course the Dallas Star Raptors in week 8 of the National Pokemon Association. Gonna pick music 7 though you guys can't hear it. That's my lucky music number. I do that for all my NPA battles. Starting starting out. I, I didn't always do that. But I'm sure Mr. Calvin here is waiting for us on the other side. So today the team consists of Don Fan, which... <coughs> Donphan is, the main point of Donphan is that it takes out, um, Sceptile, Mega Sceptile with an Ice Shard because it has Expert Belt, Adamant, Max Attack. I think it's Max Attack, I don't remember 100%. But, yeah, and then we also have Cradilly for, like, Rocks and Special Defense Wall. Completely walls out Sceptile, but can't hit it too hard. Uh, so, just Donphan's the better strategy when it comes to that. We also have Mega Metacham, of course. We have Cofagrigus, Galvantula, and Magmortar. We're going to lead with Galvantula no matter what. <clears throat> the whole point... We didn't bring Bisharp. This is the first week we haven't brought Bisharp. And I don't think that's actually a problem. Anyways, I'm going to take a picture of his team. He's got here... No Aggron. I'm expecting, like, Terrakion or something. Uh, but Webs is, like, the best thing I can do. Also, the... What's that thing called? Spiritome. I can't freely high jump kick until the Spiritome is gone. So that's annoying, but we should be able to take it. Anyways, like I said, Young Spider coming at that lead, followed up by Young Sensei, Young Trunk, Young Flower, Young Coffin, and Young Volcano. Young Volcano is actually a song by Fall Out Boy. Did I take a picture of his team? Yeah, I did. Okay. And, uh, hell, let's do it, guys. Let's get this dub. Our last video, spoiler alert, our last battle, spoiler alert, was a win. So hopefully we can pick up another. I did enjoy that a lot. Um, as always, you can find... He and his links in the description below, as well as my assistant coach Taves' Twitter. Definitely give that man a follow. He's one of my closest friends, helps me out a lot. Anyways, he's going to lead with the coughing, which means that he, or I'm sorry, not coughing, wheezing, which means that he's going to set up his toxic spikes. Now, I want to check something. I'm going to set up webs, no question. <laughs> but what I want to see, I want to see, I always get wheezing and muck confused on which one is the special defense tank wheezing is the defensive one okay so special okay he burns us which is a weird play uh, maybe expecting some sort of switch I don't know but that doesn't affect us I am just going to thunder here I have hidden power fighting as weird as it sounds I was expecting Agron to come out and be the lead uh, but I have no reason not to just thunder here not too afraid of it uh, he probably is uh, oh, oh, nice. Good job. Good job, Thunder. I'm glad you missed. Like, 90% accuracy is some crap. So he's going to be able to kill us next turn. This was honestly like a suicide lead. It doesn't really do too much. And... Yeah, so... I'm going to just come in and zen headbutt. I guess. Probably. He didn't set up Toxic Spikes. I don't... Does Weezing get Toxic Spikes? I don't think it does. I mean, I think it does. Anyways, Thunder's going to go off, and it's not going to be enough to kill, but... After a fake out, actually a thunder punch will probably take him out. I think. I can calc it, but I I honestly Well, now nah, Zen will probably be the way to go. I know Zen isn't a uh, guaranteed Oko. Yeah. Z yeah, Zen's a guaranteed Oko, but I don't want to risk it 100%. Anyways, Mega Evolve hit him with that fake out. Uh, if we see the switch into Mr. Ghost Scary Dude, then that's okay. What, what's that thing called? He's in withdrawal. Um, Spirit Dome. Milo? That's going to be Milotic. I am fine with that. Yeah, I'm completely fine with Milotic. Um, Cray Dilly, Young Flower, completely walls Milotic in a lot of ways. It's a special defensive tank. It's immune to water type attacks with Storm Drain. So I'm not too afraid about that. Uh, in addition, I also have Thunder Punch. 
Now I'm not going to use Thunder Punch. I don't think it will Oko. Especially after... What was that? Okay, so his defense is raised. But that doesn't bother me at all. all I'm going to go into Young Flower here. Can Ice Beam if he wants. Won't do anything. Uh, the Switch, definitely the way to go. I, what kind of... What kind of berry was that? I've never seen that before. Why did it um, only go off after like a little bit of damage? Huh. Uh, maybe I'll try that berry out sometime. That's a, that's a weird strategy, but I do like it, Key. I do like it. Key is a skillful opponent. I do know that for sure. So, Anyways, Young Flower coming out. Unless he has like nothing, actually. Let me eat that. Yum, yum, yum. Now, what could he go into here? Possibly the Simi Seer. Possibly the Simi Seer. I kind of... I kinda just want to set up rocks, I guess. I have I have Hidden Power Ice, if needed, for the Sceptile. Because I also Hardwall Sceptile with this thing too. Um, but I'll just set up rocks. Sceptile is really definitely scary. Yeah, okay, here comes Simi Seer for sure, right? No, here comes out Toxic again. Okay. He's going to want to get that burn off, I know. No, that's what he's going to go for. So I can actually go into Magmortar. Possibly set up a substitute. Would that be a good idea this early? Probably not. Um, but yeah, I'm definitely going to be expecting that burn here. So I'll go into Young Volcano. <sighs> Getting webs was important. Pain Split. Oh. I guess that works too. Um, Fire Blast. Does it? I don't think it Oko's. Do I have Psychic? I think I have Earthquake. I had Earthquake on for the muck. Psychic would have been better. But I'll just Fire Blast here. Should be enough to take him out. I believe it, I calced it earlier, and I believe it did almost kill. And, you know, he has some health gone now. So I think, I think we're good. Fire Blast gonna go off. Yeah. Yeah, that's a dead, that's a dead guy. He did. So that's good for us. Um. We're also pretty fast, too. Just because, uh, you know, rocks. Or not rocks. I, I made it to where without, um, I made it to where I can outspeed Scrafty, I think it was. It was something that I needed to outspeed. I, just, I made it to where I can outspeed it by one point. But sticky webs are up, so that's not going to happen either way for him. Um, Simi Seer is going to come out now. I don't, I don't know too much what this thing has for us. And after, like, I'm, I'm thinking about, in all honesty, going for the sub here. Can I really? I can hit him with Earthquake. Okay, I'm going to sub here, see what he does. Obviously, we're faster, unless he's... No, okay. Even if he is Scarf, we might have been faster. I don't know. He's going to rock to him. Ooh, scary. Okay. I see you. Um, that's going to break it, right? Critical hit. Oh, that helps even more. Um, what does Mag do a lot against his team? Mag is also going to be pretty... Ugh, I kind of messed up with Mag. He's at pretty low health. Okay. Maybe just Earthquake. See what happens. Okay, I'm going to real quickly... You guys, I'm, gonna, I'm not going to block it out. Or I will block it out. I need to just change the back buffer on the capture card so it's a little bit less laggy. So hold on one second. Okay, sorry about that. You guys see that number in like the top left or whatever. That just... It's going to be less laggy and more smooth now. Okay, so Earthquake comes off. Will it be enough to kill? That substitute might have been dumb play. Yeah, nice. It's enough to kill. I should have calculated. it. Um, but either way, we got rid of his Simi Seer as well. So that's good. We're losing a little bit because of Life Orb. Definitely not enough to make a sub now. Um, we still have enough. I mean, I don't know if he has like Shadow Sneak or whatever on his Spirit Tome. I'm assuming he probably does. Okay, so he's going back into Milotic. Rocks are going to go up. Yeah, I'm definitely, there's really no point of me not to go into Create Dilly here. No point at all. So, I'm just going to do that. Go straight into Young Flower. It was named Young Dildo, but... Dildo's a bad word. Oh, okay. okay, Pokemon. Dildo's a bad word. Yeah. You know, Dildos are a part of culture. I'm going to just stop. Hidden Power. Hidden Power. No, nothing. Hidden Power, nothing. Hidden Power, nothing. Nothing, sweetie. Okay, so, I guess I'll just Giga Drain here. No point in not. He can, like, switch into whatever. Sceptile. If he switches into Sceptile, I'll get a free Hidden Power Ice. I mean, I'll take that. It's a two-hit KO. 
He's in withdrawal. And, like, Sceptile can't touch us. Skeptic, that's gonna be... Sceptile, yeah. Yeah, I'll just stay in him power ice. Don't wrong me. I mean, Sticky Webs goes off too, which is helpful in the long run, but... For this, like... First thing right here, it doesn't matter too much. Capture card's pretty choppy today. I don't know why. Maybe if I close... Yeah, I haven't dropped any frames. I'll close down the calcs that I have open. Maybe that'll help. I don't know. Um, anyways, yeah, Hidden Power Ice. Definitely not going to be expecting this, I don't think. Uh, he could Mega and Sub here. I don't know if everyone runs Sub, Sceptile. I do, all the time, 100%. Um, I doubt Key is, because I don't think it's like a standard set. He can Dragon Pulse here. I don't definitely don't think that'll be enough to KO. N not even close, because we are built to, you know, wall special. Focus Blast! Ah, that's true, I forgot Subsile gets that. Uh, without a doubt, unless it's a crit, can live it. Nice. Can use Hidden Power. Gonna be four times super effective, almost enough to take him out. After Leftovers, do I risk it? Yeah, I risk it. Ah, I risk it, whatever. I mean, he can miss too, which is always the cool thing. I'd be down for if he missed. Um, regardless, whatever he switches into now with Sceptile is, uh, it, it's not going to really enjoy. Like, whenever Sceptile comes back out, sorry, I got stuttered for a second. Uh, whenever it comes back out, rocks are going to kill it. So he can D-Pulse right here. That's, mm -mm. that was, yeah, that's not the thing. Uh, but our HP... Ice goes off and it's enough to take out his Mega, which is actually a huge threat out of the way for us. So that's good news right there. I'm gonna take some lefties recovery. Definitely gonna save this thing in the back for my Lotic, just because you know. Yeah. Um. Don't know what he's gonna go into. Terrakion, quite possibly could be scarfed. He's gonna go into what's this? Tra up there's Terrakion. All right. Well, Terrakion gets hard walled by Cofagrigus, so I'm gonna go into Young Coffin here. Uh, Stealth Rocks breaks any potential Sash. Don't think he was Sashed. Actually, I can go to Young Trunk, too. Uh, it might be the better play. Then, yeah, no, I'll go to Young Coffin. Young Coffin is out here, okay? There we go. Young Coffin coming out. I actually really like Kefagagus. There's a few Pokemon that I've just learned to use for the first time in this league. Such as Cafagrigus. Um, oh, he got the poison! Oh my god, man. Uh, but at least he gets the mummy. No justified for him, which means we can knock off. Knock off that scarf, but that would probably help him. So I'm not gonna do that. I'm not gonna deal with that. This poison doesn't matter too much to me at all. I guess I'll just throw out the burn here. Yeah, I'll just throw out the burn. Definitely the play to do it. Completely will shut down this Terrakion on him. Yeah, he's gonna switch. Uh, if he goes into the... No, he's gonna go to my lock. Okay, so Marvel Scale is a thing. I don't know if he has anything to hit us. But, like, why would I switch when I have... Yeah, okay. Okay. That's gonna go off. Speed is lowered. He's definitely still uh, gonna be able to outspeed. My nature is minus speed because... Uh, I have knockoff and shadow ball so it puts him pretty low it's like what else okay we need Cofagrigus for okay uh, I'll go to young flower here he might predict it or do something I don't know and no bears so I guess we'll see recover smart smart um unfortunately for him though we have Giga Drain so we're gonna get a lot of health too um, if we want to, we can recover. We get our lefties. I don't think an Ice Beam is going to be enough to take us out. So, the recover is definitely the better play here. Just, you know, bearing a switch. So, I'll go for the recover right now. He's going to hit in power. It didn't, wasn't it not very effective? Or just neutral. Yeah. I'm surprised he doesn't have Ice Beam. What hidden power could that be? Hidden power fire, probably. Yeah, hit power fire, definitely. Um, anyways, we're at almost full health, and now we can just Giga Drain our heart's consent, really. Uh, burn damage going down, which is always nice for us. Yeah, Giga Drain. Definitely play. 
Ice? Oh, he does have Ice Beam. Okay. Uh, I'm not too worried about this doing much at all. Oh, it's super effective. I forgot about that, actually. He could have killed us, maybe. Hmm. Could he have? I don't know. It's close. It's close. He still has speeds, which is unfortunate. Which means this might turn into a stall or Oh, God. Who wants to see that? Um. Yeah. I'll just continue Giga Draining. Yeah, that Hidden Power Ice on Crate Dilly came through. Okay, well, I think he's dead, actually, now. Which is mucho bueno. Okay, we live that fine Giga Drain. But a bam There you go. So we're in a really good position right now. We've taken out a lot of his Pokemon at the moment. Getting some more lefties back. Putting us in the green, which is even better. Nice, nice. It's gonna go into this thing. Oh, okay. So this thing finally comes out. I'm pretty scared of this. Uh, but sticky web is helpful. I don't know what kind of set these things are. Pressure! Oh god, it's all over. Um, so I think it'd be best to start off with the recover. I mean, I don't know if it's special. I think these things are. Hold on, let me. Ugh, I already closed the tabs. At this point, I can just risk the recover. It's no big deal. We're out. We outspeed. Okay, so that's good to know. I guess. Will-O-Wisp. Oh, smart. Oh, cool. Okay. Dodging. We dodging bullets here. Yeah. Okay, he's leftover, so he's probably tanky. I want to look at his stats. I apologize if it freezes up a little bit, but I need to know. What's this thing called? What is this thing called? I forget the name of this dark type. It's not... I want to say Cofagragus, but it's obviously not. Oh my god, dude. Spirit Tome. Spirit Tome. It's stats R. Smogon? Where's the Smogon link? I always look at Smogon. Uh, it is definitely a run more on the side of... Oh god, it can be either. It has high special defense and defense. Alright, well, I'll just get you during. We'll see what it does. <laughs> that was crappy. Alright, he's gonna taunt. I mean, I guess I'm fine with that. It's whatever. Does he get recovered? I don't know. I guess we'll see. Just throw out another. Another one. I mean, if we take him down to the point, like, he can take out me all. He can take me out, whatever. Uh, the Willow was obvious there. I honestly could have pulled the switch. But, I mean, it doesn't matter. I can lose Cradily. Cradily does nothing to me. Uh, does nothing besides. I guess kind of help against this thing because his last Pokemon is Terrakion after this and I, it gets completely walled by Donphan and Cofagrigus. I kind of want to go to Donphan just to finish it up because you know, Donphan's pretty cool, right? Foul play. I'm not too worried about that. Yeah, not too worried at all. So we're, in a, we're still in a really good position here. Not too worried. I, I wanted to get Toxic. I think I originally had Toxic on my Cradily, but then the Hidden Power Ice, like uh, my assistant coach Tabe suggested Hidden Power Ice. Because all we had for Sceptile was the Expert Belt um, Dawn Fan. Because, like, I don't really have any fast Ice types on my team. But he said Hidden Power Ice, and I was like, yeah, good idea. Alright, Pain Split. That might be annoying, but as we get to the lower health, that's not bother me. Okay, well, he, you know what I'm gonna let? I'm gonna let him do his thing for a couple more turns, right? And then when I think he's gonna pain split, I'll go into Magmortar. I can risk it at this point. Taunt wore off, I can recover too. I think I'll do that. Um, if this gets too stally, I will start the speed up now! Okay. But if it's not too stolly, how you doing, baby girl? You looking fine today. Someone commented the other day, and they're like, dude, your commentary is so cringy. And I was like, okay, thanks. Because it was kind of like, dude, you're on my video, on my channel. I want to do me. Just kind of be happy with it. Like, that's what I do. I do YouTube because it makes me happy. I love recording. I love talking into a microphone in an empty room by myself and secluding myself in a room all day. It's, it's what I like to do. That's what I like to do. 
I don't know. People can be ruthless in the comments, I swear to god. Half the people in the world hate me because I, I didn't say Mega Victini on my top 10 Megas evolutions from Legendaries. Sorry, everybody. Pain split. Okay. God, I should predict that. Uh, you know what? I actually, I'm just. This has gone on for far too long. I'm gonna Giga Drain, and then I'm gonna switch. Like he, he's really doing nothing. I don't want to speed it up because this commentary is golden. I don't want you guys to miss on that. Okay, wait. What? He has foul play, right? All right, I'll Giga Drain. And then, yeah, it's whatever. This has been pretty awful. I don't know why I've been doing this. Like, thinking about it, I could have... I mean, it's a safe thing to do. Oh, he paints put it that quickly? Is that all he got? I think he'll do it again. All right, whatever. You know what? We're going into Magmortar this turn. Screw it. I got nothing to lose. I got nothing to lose. And guys, if you think my commentary is cringy, I apologize that you don't like it. You know, I just try my hardest to, uh, I just be real with you. I just be real with you. <clears throat> Anyways, we're gonna switch out, and that stupid stall BS. Please, pain split. Please. Foul play, of course, the 120 foul plays. Will that kill? Oh, God. Oh, my life. Alright, well, that stall needed to end. I need to end. I'm just gonna go into Metacham or whatever. No, Foul Play will kill me. Ugh. You know what? I'll burn him. Duh. That's a good idea. Um, he's probably faster. Will he taunt? I'll just Will O Wisp. He can't pain split me. Ha! Oh, we outspeed and Will O Wisp hits. Okay, well, this thing's now shut down. 100%. Alright, okay, so we outspend. Bueno, mucho bueno. Um, I don't care about anything else, like, it's kind of just knockoff Shadow Ball from here. The knockoff will help a lot. He can't pain split us, I don't think, unless pain splits mechanics work differently or something. He, he's done, he's done, he's out of here. He should use Memento if he has that. I don't think he does. Don't think you got Memento. I don't think you have Diet Coke and Mentos. Knockoff, bam. Say goodbye to your leftovers. Ha <laughs> ha. Foul play. Oh yeah, I forgot. Foul play super effective. I mean, you're burned. My attack's really low. I'm, I'm not worried about it anymore. Now you got mummy. You didn't want that, dude. You didn't want mummy. Yeah, cool. So I don't even think I'm gonna have to speed it up. That's good. Because I said some pretty killer, killer lines, dude. So yeah, everything's actually going bad for him at this point. It really is. Um, yeah, we'll just. Shadow Ball. Shadow Ball till our heart's content, really. Bam! Hella damage. Kind of. A little. Not really. But enough to wear, like, one more after two burn damages, which we'll get after next turn. Will be enough to take him out! So, yeah, that's good. Um, when he goes into his... Terrakion, he'll be able to kill me. Probably. I don't know. Might not. But I, I really want to finish this with Don Fans. Because, like, Don Fan was like, we built this whole entire team for Donphan, honestly. <laughs> like, Donphan was like such a big member, and he hasn't done anything at all. Because Sticky Webs and, uh, oh, oh, noise, noise, noise. It's enough to take him out there. Um, Sticky Webs and Rocks was like enough to like destroy him, in all honesty. So does, I, I don't know why I think this. Like, yo, he might go into, he might knock off if he's scarfed into knock off. I could see that. I'm not gonna unscarf him though and knock off. I mean, I think he'll kill me if he does have knockoff. Mm, I don't know. Whatever. I'm just gonna do Willow. Cause why not? EQ. Smart, I guess. Um, not enough. No. Willow comes off. Oh, he avoids it. Alright, well, we're dead this turn. Lucky for him. Guess you got away with it this time, Key. Um, yeah. Pretty sure EQ doesn't even kill Medi, so like, if we want it, I'm gonna knock, yeah. 
Should knock off. Got rid of that scarf. Pretty sure he's scarfed. I don't know. Whatever. Earthquake should kill with expert belt. Either way. Critical hit! That mattered. Um, but yeah, Dunfan finishes off, making this a 3-0. I mean, I'm going to predict that. I guess I don't necessarily know. But we have Sturdy, and we have Max Attack, Expert Belt, Earthquake. So, I'm going to assume. I'm going to assume. Also, I think we have 252 defense. Yeah. Yeah, he's definitely... Uh, is he scarfed? Yeah, yeah that's, that's enough. Cool. So that's gonna be the battle, guys. Week eight, we bring home another W. Sorry, there's a little bit of that stall with the Cradilly. That was kind of boring to watch. I, I'm sure. Hopefully, my commentary made up for it. I don't know. I, I try to entertain you guys the best of my abilities. I mean, of course, it's all natural and whatever. Uh, but I'm rambling. The whole point is to check out Key and the people that provided me with that background music, aka Glitch X City and KMX, two of the best video game remixers out there please check them out uh, and like i said keys twitch twitter youtube all in the desk as well uh and follow tapes too tapes is a really nice guy um anyways guys i'm out remember to like if you like dislike if you disliked and subscribe if you want to see more awesome comment comments if you want to see more more awesome content if you want to see more awesome content then hit that sub button have a nice day guys and as always let the outro roll <laughs>